Hello there guys, this is Jack One Day talking here and today I've got another video for you. So in today's video we are talking about the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060 and when we can get it, the price and also the specs. Before I get into the video, can you please leave a like and comment your thoughts down below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn that bell notifications on as I'm on the road to 10,000 subscribers and it'll be greatly appreciated. So let's get into the juicy stuff. Specs. It looks like the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060 will come with a new SKU of the Ampere GPU named the GA106-300A1, built on the 8 nanometer process. The card supports DirectX 12 Ultimate. Apparently it will come with the 3840 CUDA cores. In terms of memory, it's likely that this card will come with 6 gigabytes of DDR6 memory. The GPU is operating at a frequency of 1770 MHz, which can be boosted up to 1860 MHz. Memory is running at 1750 MHz. It also features 3840 shading units, 120 texture mapping units, and also 64 ROPs, which is aka raster operation pipeline or render output units. It's also rumoured that there will be 120 tensor cores which help improve the speed of machine learning applications. The card also has 30 ray tracing acceleration cores and the power consumption is only 180 watts according to this leak. My recommended gaming resolutions for this GPU would be anything up to 4K. However, this is heavily dependent on which titles you play. Something like League of Legends will be a breeze. However, Call of Duty on the other hand, it will struggle to keep the competitive edge with a high stable frame rate. I'll suggest playing games at 1440 or 1080p with this GPU for the majority. Feel free to pause the video to take a more in-depth read of the key features and specs shown on screen. And I'll leave a lot of key information down below in the description too, so check that out. Anyway, price. For one, with the RTX 2000 series, we got to see the 2060 be the lowest end card. We would have thought that Nvidia was planning on doing the same this year, but they could choose to go a step lower to bring a more pocket friendly card that can do ray tracing. For example, the RTX 3050. So make sure you stay tuned for a video on that very soon. The RTX 2060 had a price tag that started around 310 US dollars. On the other hand, the GTX 1050 was priced from 110 US dollars. It's safe to assume that Nvidia will price the 3060 between 270 and 350 US dollars, making it a pretty decent entry level ray tracing gaming experience. I don't want to sit here and do all the conversion rates for pounds, euros and yen and everything like that, so feel free to do that conversion yourself. Release date. We can expect to see the 3060 sometime in the first half of 2021. Many believe we can see as early as January or February, which is great news. Nvidia are hosting an event on the 2nd of December where they'll be showcasing the 3060 Ti. So we could also expect them to mention the non-TI model too. Stay tuned for more news on this by hitting that subscribe button. Make sure to also check out my video on how you can have the best chances on buying one of these or any of the 3000 series cards. I can back up the tips and tricks mentioned in that video as I use them to cop one of the RTX 3070s. Anyway guys, that's it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed it and you found it useful. If so, please smash that thumbs up button Leave any comments down below if you've got thoughts. And make sure you subscribe and turn that bell notification on for more great videos like this. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.